So now I'm just going to channel um, the energies of this week, what my guides feel um, the energies are. And there's three, I've already tuned in, um, and there's three main aspects, and they're all positive, really, So, which is great. <laughs> so um, the first one is, for a lot of you, there's some great success coming your way this week. Um, it's almost like your hard work has is paying off, um, or some sort of victory as well. But I'll, I'll, I'll channel it properly in a minute. But just giving you a little summary, um, and then there's a need, which is great. That's brilliant for others of you. There's a bit more need to balance things in your life, um, especially financially. So sometimes we can hold on to money too much, which actually stops the flow of money coming to us, which I know sounds a bit funny, but it's true. And sometimes we can spend too much, which also kind of stops the flow. So it's about getting some balance in there and also not uh, not being too extreme in any of your action taking this week too. And also sort of more towards the end of the week, we have um, more of a romantic theme going on. So those of you who are single may indeed be meeting somebody this week. Um, or even if you're not single, things might just feel a bit more romantic. There's a lot more love coming in. So it's all good, right? Um, and, you know, obviously, as always, looking after yourself, okay? All right, so hi Maria. So I'll just um, bring them in to give you some more detail on those three themes, but they are the three themes from what I've been told. Okay, right. Hello everyone, it's a pleasure to be here today again. Thank you for joining us and for watching this video. Right, always already given you a summary of what to um, or maybe what to expect, but what to watch out for, what to work with this week. So the, the week on a whole has some very positive energy, actually, even though you may have heard about Mercury going retrograde and lots of other planets going retrograde. Do not worry, okay? It doesn't mean that your life has to stop. <laughs> Things are still happening. So there's a very big theme around success this week for many of you. So some of you have been working very hard on planting the seeds, growing your businesses or growing anything that you want to succeed in. And this is the week where you're most likely to receive kind of your reward for that. And that could even be if you're in a job, a promotion, it could be a new um, or new clients in your business. It could be in your personal life, but we feel it's more likely to be around work and business. So anything that you've been working on coming into fruition and you know, you're reaping the rewards, a bit like the harvest season. Um, also, um, there could be new opportunities heading your way as well, which is going to lead to greater success. Also, for some of you, and this doesn't happen very often, there may well be just a pleasant surprise that you've um, that there's some money on its way to you that you didn't know was coming. So um, we don't often mention things like that. But this come through quite clear for some of you. And then um, the the other theme is getting some balance. So again, this for. We were going to say this feels like business, but actually it's more just money generally. So what we've been shown is that this is a period where of reflection. It's the autumn. People are starting to reflect on where they are, looking at their money, perhaps thinking about planning for the future, perhaps planning for Christmas, or maybe there's some investments that you want to make. Um, here, it's just about not being too extreme, okay? So if you are planning to invest, look at the investments quite carefully um, before you hand your money over. Um, equally, don't be uh, 
as we said, there's extremes. So some of you might be fearing losing your money, so you're holding on to it, or you're not sure about an investment, which deep down your intuition is saying, yes, go for it, but you're not really sure, like your head's getting in the way, your ego's getting in the way. So just really tune in as to whether it is um, something that's going to benefit you. We suggest you tune in um, from your heart as well, um, because quite often that, well, always that knows right and ask your guides as well um but don't be fearful of letting money go because sometimes and what we mean is for things that you know will be good for you because um sometimes when you hold on to money and don't do something which is going to bring you happiness that actually puts a block on you receiving more money in the future and that's for anything um, that you're trying to bring into your life so just balance also don't go too extreme with throwing your money around it's just one of those weeks where you need to tune into your heart and your head actually and combine them and see uh see what feels right for you okay um but nothing you know in business actually if the part of this wait uh, the part of this which is for business is actually saying, you know, again, just bring some more balance in, make sure you're not um, concentrating on um, too many areas at once, see which ones are the ones that are bringing you in the most joy, but also um, the most reward, okay? And then, the other theme which is flying around this week is romance, okay? So, Right at the beginning of September, we mentioned romance, and it's become stronger as the month's gone on, but particularly this month, and of course we know that October starts at the end of the week, but we feel it's a good time for romance for some of you. You may well meet somebody new There's, um, if you're single. Um, also, uh, if you're in a relationship, it could become a little bit more... Um, emotional but in a good way sort of strengthening of connection so all round it's a good week um, it's a, and particularly if you really um, tune in to what it is you need and desire and what's right for you as ever don't compare yourself to others really look at what you need this week um, it is a good week for reflection as well so but as well as reflecting on perhaps what hasn't gone right over the last nine months, please do also reflect on what has gone right because a lot of you have achieved far more than you think. All right, so we hope that helps you. But there's also, yeah, a feeling of luck this week. So um, we hope we are showering you with that look right now. So that's about it for now. And um, we'll see you again next week okay so that sounds all very promising